Oh yeah, it is. The first piece. Follow Lobo's instructions to uncover the first artifact. This is the spot. Watch your back and follow your mar marker to find the first piece of the artifact. Alright, but... Dig up the hidden artifact. Yeah, I thought they were going to make like a map. Like a that zombie type of thing. And, and take the other piece. Mozambique. So we gotta go here. Makes sense. Up at, oh shit. Oh shit. Proceed cautiously. We aren't alone here. Dang. Complete and... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, they're right there. Oh, they're not even that strong. Okay, yeah, they're not that strong. I thought they are going to be a lot stronger. That would be pretty cool if they uh, made it, made this into like a mode. Where it's kind of like surviving, kind of like Call of Duty Zombies or something like... What's that thing where they had the aliens? In Modern Warfare, I think 3? Let's look at right there. Wait, can I fake them out? Bam goes the boozle. Ha. Oh boy. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> that effect's close. I can't close this. Okay. No, he knows! He knows. Hold on. Bamboozle. Okay, so yeah, we can fake them out. Cool, cool, cool. I'm not sure. Oh, we have six minutes. Okay, we have six minutes. We have to hurry up. It's pretty cool using Mirage for this. He's dead. We need more ammo. I'm not sure how long it's going to take to dig up, though. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hurry up, hurry up. Dig up. Not the first one. Not the first one to come looking for it. Hold on. Not the first ones to come through here looking for it. Oh, I couldn't read it. There's so many of these guys. Okay, let's go. Come on, dig up the hidden artifact. We're almost done. Got it. Did we get it? Oh, damn. Okay, so we just all we have to do is just survive gonna attract them or worse is there something worse than that Let's go over there i want it's gonna get prowlers and shadows shadows who the hell are the shadows they're all kind of just hanging out over there are we almost done Where are the shadows at? Is it ready? Pick it up. We gotta go. Scratch it. Complete. Get the artifact piece and get out of there. All right. We have a minute. I just gotta get out of here alive. Okay. Get on the board. Yo, they're coming. Okay. Oh my god. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Yo, we made it. Oh my god, we have a minute. Can I fight them? Oh, I can't. Oh, that's cool. We're gonna probably do this every... Every week, I think, right? It's gonna be like a weekly thing. That's actually really cool. Alright, so now let's see what we got. The Cranky Clown, Chapter 1. So we had this meeting in the Labra. The Lavery? The place where you go to the bathroom? <laughs> That's because at the Paradise Lounge, we don't do private rooms. Here, we believe in doing, being social, connecting with people, coming together as humans. Look, the point is, I'm cranky. You're in a bad mood. Is this Mirage's story? What? Yeah. No. I'm not. What do you know? More than you might think. Damn, Wraith. Here it comes. 189 reasons why all the different versions of myself are bummed out. <laughs> I say as I hand Wraith her apple teeny. I know, right? I would totally make fun of her too, but I saw what happened to the last guy. And I like the idea of having kids one day. So I'll stick to with my poker face. Thanks. Only need one reason. It bothers you that Loba knows your mom's secret. And that's when it hits me. It bothers me that Loba knows mom's secret. Mom's secret? What the hell? She knew about my parents too. More in that. She knows how I feel about them and I don't go spreading that. I think she got dirt on all of us. Oh, that's Lifeline. How does she know? She is similarly aware of the allegations against me. All patently false and absurd, of course. That these 
Cretans continued to mistake me for a corpse is preposterous. Oh yeah, she told uh, Caustic that he was innocent. And what's she gonna do for me, huh? Help me run faster? Hey, can she do that? Bunch of marks, all of you. Damn, Bangalore. Bangalore so that she spits onto the floor that I, that someone will have to clean later. <laughs> She bats her eyelashes and you all fall in line, advancing into unknown territories to obtain some trinket. We don't even know what the what this hunk of junk is. Uh, crypto. I've been studying it and it looks like it's encasing a matrix, but it needs its other half to fully... That wasn't a question. Only reason I went to that awful place was to make sure none of you ended up in a body bag. Or as Caustic's latest experiment. No, instead, we get to be Loba's little errand boys. Damn, Bangalore. Why do you hate her? I thought um, Loba looked up to Bangalore though, because she's like the the boss. I don't know about all of you, but I didn't sign up to take orders from some two-bit thief when I signed my legends contract. If the IMC was still running the show, it should be halfway to the brig by 0500. So what's the plan? We walk away? Then we're more in the dark than before. For now, follow her lead, but we do our own private re re reconnaissance. But... So Loba hates uh, Revenant. There's people that are on Revenant's side that told him about all of this. She's not telling us everything. I overheard her talking to someone named Yoko at Hammond Robotics about a meeting Loba had with the higher ups there. Yo, I've got a date with a girl named Yoko from Hammond. Think they know each other? Wow, room got real quiet after that one. And life is about two decibels too high when she says, A date? Gyon, which, uh... <laughs> Does this girl know what she's getting herself into? Bangalore cuts in, which is annoying because, hi, you had your turn, and we want to see Lifeline kick Octane's butt now, but sure, Bangalore, your thing is important too, I guess. Octane, you know this girl? She asked if I wanted to get a drink. I was thirsty and said, sure, but she meant tomorrow. I mean, I'll be thirsty tomorrow too, but I didn't know, man. She wants me to wait for things. Like, wait? Just around? Gee, you not going on this date. Girl ain't deserve an attitude like that. Yes, he is going. Never turned down intel. Never turned good intel down. And right now, your boy's your only way to get your hands on some. Octane, we need you to find out what this meeting between Loba and Hammond was all about. And I need proof so she can't deny the whole thing. Anything they've got. Wow, so you're going to force him to go on a date with this chick. To, like, get intel. You're going to let this poor girl sit around the torture of this date for your intel? She's tortured. I have to wear pants. <laughs> I like to raise, he's watching Octane get bounced back and forth between Bangalore and Lifeline like a ping pong ball. She turns to me, shaking her head. And you think I'm intense. I know better than to answer that question, so I say, I know better than to answer that question. But Wraith has a point. I've never seen Bangs this worked up. If I were Loba Andred, I'd be shaking at my thigh highs because right now I know two things. Bangalore won't stop until she sent Loba Andred packing. And nights like this are totally why I bought a bar. Oh, so this is his bar, like his nightclub type of thing. The detached chaperone. So that's going to be the next one after this. We got to wait, what? Uh, yeah, so it's every week. Treasure packs. We need three more. I think we might have collected them. So we just have to wait till next week until we can uh, continue the story. That's pretty cool. I wonder what the story behind everybody else is going to be. Because Caustic, they said that he was innocent from something. They all signed contracts. So it's like... If you win, are you able to get out of your contract? Like, maybe if Caustic wins, he's able to just get out of the accusations of whatever he did or didn't do. What happened to uh, Mirage's parents or his mom that Loba knows? Because I think she's able to hack into everything. I don't know, that's cool.